So what is a Security Operations Center, or SOC, use case, and why do they matter? First off, let's avoid all the indecipherable jargon used by experts. Let's talk about a use case like any other business process. There are three main components. The first component is detection. Uh, these are the security analytics used to detect something undesirable that merits creating an alert for further investigation. It can be as simple as an algorithm matching three failed consecutive logins or involve machine learning models related to anomalous behavior. Second, connectivity or integration, which are required for the use case. For instance, if you wanted to lock a, a user in Active Directory, you'd need connectivity with Active Directory in the first place to do this. If you wanted to kill a process or quarantine a file, you'd need connectivity to an endpoint. But this isn't necessarily just security platforms. It could be something like ServiceNow to open an incident with IT, requesting a specific laptop be re-imaged to corporate standards, or request a specific patch be applied. Thirdly, you need manual and automated responses. These are the procedures used and may even be a combination of automated and manual actions to contain a threat. This could be as simple as lock out a user automatically and unlock one speaking with the end user to complex responses involving several decision trees. This all matters because numerous technical and business roles need effective collaboration to create the desired security outcome. Without a use case structure, the process will easily fail to accomplish the desired result.